don't get get so much time to chill out but when i do i mean i'm actually very already happy with a, a movie or you know gaming with friends or um just going out to eat with a bunch of friends i it's it's mainly just you know if i can do something with my friends because i don't see them that often so that um that that will probably be my thing if i'm not working When I'm at festivals, I always try to check out guys that I don't know that well or, you know, play something that I don't know because I believe that in every music there's something that, you know, makes people move and interests people and I kind of try to, I kind of try to de define that certain thing and try to incorporate that in my music. So that's one thing. The other thing is I just listen to radio, but not to pop stations. I'd rather listen to a jazz station or... Maybe golden oldies or what you know, just different stuff because you know there's so much good music uh, being made, and I think if you listen to other stuff than than you know your normal chart stuff, um, it's easier to you know get original or like find something that no one has used for a while. So I, I think that's that's why. It just depends on the, on on the idea. If I start with the beat or the melody. Um, yeah, I mean like sometimes you actually have a musical idea in your head that you want to get out and then you usually start I mean you always start with the kick because you know you need your tempo, but uh, then I usually start out with with the melody first um, And sometimes you you just have a certain idea of um, you, you know you really need a specific club record for your set so then you usually start out with beats but I think in general I start out with the melodic part first because if you know in what key your um, your song is going to be you can tune your kick right away and, and tune your other things as well so uh, that's usually the easiest I use Logic most of the time I do a few little things in Ableton but uh, I still think that uh, I think Ableton is really great it works really fast but I still think that uh, um, it, it adds a little sound to your your audio files and I think Logic is more open, um, especially sound-wise. It's a little bit harder to create something, but uh, in the end you have more um, room. I mean, it doesn't give a sound by itself, so it's easier to create whatever you, you want. In that case, it's uh, it's very easy. I mean, that's actually another another good thing. I mean, there are so many sample packs, and usually if you check out, the, um, it's either synth shots or sometimes it's called uh, percussion or percussion elements. You can find all these little fun uh, samples, basically. And uh, you know, usually if you put a lot of verb on it or you know a nice delay, distort it a little bit, you know, work with it a little bit. That's usually, and that's what I did in the case of uh, No Good, it's just a, a sample from a sample pack. My favorite pizza topping. Uh, wow, that's hard. I hardly ever eat pizza because I try to eat a healthy, but uh, if I eat pizza, then um, I don't know. I, I just love cheese so much. So, you know, quattro formaggi or something like that, I would definitely like. Um, really like meat as well, so. Anything meat they can slap on a pizza is pretty much good. I'm not such a big fish fan, so probably nothing like that. And you know, some vegetables and the usual stuff.